The first suspect is a Caldwell County resident who faces multiple drug charges and is also charged with violating probation. He remained in jail here in Catawba County as of earlier today and has a court date scheduled next week. 46-year-old Jose Manuel Flores of Village Drive in Granite Falls was arrested Tuesday by Hickory Police. He's charged with felony possession of methamphetamine, along with misdemeanor counts of possession of marijuana, possession of drug paraphernalia, and resisting a public officer. Flores is also charged with felony probation violation. He was detained in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $30,000 bond and remained in jail as of earlier today. He was scheduled to appear in district court Wednesday on the drug and resisting an officer charges. A superior court appearance is scheduled for next Monday on the probation violation charge. 61-year-old Floyd Wayne Hedrick of Young Drive in Conover was arrested Monday by Newton police officers. He's charged with possession of methamphetamine, two counts of maintaining a vehicle dwelling or place to keep controlled substance, possession of marijuana up to one half ounce, and possession of drug paraphernalia. Hedrick was jailed in the Catawba County Detention Facility in Newton under $10,500 bond. A district court date is scheduled next Monday. The next suspect is a Hickory woman who faces a felony drug charge following an arrest earlier this week. 43-year-old Margaret Louise Lynch of 2nd Street Place Southwest in Hickory was arrested Wednesday by Hickory Police. She's charged with felony possession of Schedule 4 controlled substance. Lynch was jailed in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $4,000 bond and remained in jail as of earlier today. A district court appearance was scheduled today. 44-year-old Jason Gerard Glenn who is listed as a homeless person from Hickory, was arrested by Hickory police last Friday on felony counts of breaking and entering a motor vehicle and larceny of a motor vehicle. Glenn was taken into custody without incident at 12.03 a.m. last Friday at a business address on 2nd Street Place Southeast in Hickory. He was placed in the Catawba County Detention Facility under $4,000 secured bond, he remained in jail as of earlier today. A district court appearance is scheduled for November 22nd. Reporting from Catawba County, I'm Rob Eastwood, WHKY-TV News.